Hi lovelies, welcome to my channel and to another in the dressing room video. Today I am at Target and I think I'm going to try on blouses. When I think of blouses, I think of like workwear or even dressier tops. So that's kind of what I'm going for today. If you're new to my channel, I just wanted to say hi, I'm Kathy. I'm really glad that you're here. I hope you will stick around and subscribe down below. And if you like this kind of video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up and let's head into Target. There were a ton of blouses in the store, so I decided to only grab the short sleeve ones for today's video. The first top I grabbed is this light blue v-neck top. It has these really pretty flutter sleeves, v-neck, and I tried this one on in a size small and it was $15. I love the color of this top, especially for spring. The neckline is nice and the sleeves are really pretty. I did wish that it were a little bit longer. I thought it fell a little bit awkward on me. It's a little stiff. The fabric definitely wrinkles easily. So I like this top in theory, but it just didn't work for my body type. And this top does come in a bunch of other colors as well. The next top is this orange puff sleeve top. It has gathered sleeves and a gathered neckline as well. And it does have this cute tie and cutout in the back. And I tried this one on in a size small and it was $18. This top has a lot of potential, I would say. I think the puff sleeves are great and the back is beautiful, although it did ride up a little bit, but I think the tie is so fun and I love how the back is low. So I really wanted to like this one, but I think that I would feel like I need to fix it a lot while wearing it, which would make it uncomfortable. And Target does have this top in multiple other solid colors. The next top I tried on is this red eyelet top. It has has the eyelet embroidery and lattice at the bottom with a scalloped hem and same on the sleeves and the top and I tried this one on in a size small and it was $29.99. Although red would probably not be my first choice, I do really like this top. I think the eyelet and lattice details are really beautiful. I love the scalloped hem on the sleeves and the bottom hem as well. It is plain on the back which I think made it more comfortable and I really like how this one fit me as well. I think it has the right amount of details without compromising on the comfort of the shirt and they also have this top in light purple olive white and navy next is this rusty orange button front top it has puff sleeves the buttons running down the front and i tried this one on in a size small and it was twenty dollars this one has a very boxy fit the puff sleeves are nice they're not overly puffy and the buttons down the front are nice as well it has a panel of fabric behind the space in between the buttons. You can see it's not at the top, it's covered, it's covered, it's covered, and then it ends and is open at the bottom. And so I thought that was a really nice detail that they put in there. I thought it was made well. It's just not my personal fit of choice, but I do really like the color that I tried it on in and the other colors that it comes in. This green floral, the navy, and this white with these subtle stars on it, I think is really pretty. The next top I grabbed is this gold eyelet ruffle top. The sleeves are gathered with the sleeves and the ruffle at the top having these beautiful cutouts in them and it's gathered at the waist as well and I tried this one on in a size small and it was $27.99. My initial assessment of this top is that it has a lot going on. The gathering at the waist definitely gave me a nice shape and I like the cutouts on the sleeves as well. The part that I can't really get past on this shirt is the giant ruffle on the top. It's just not really my style, but they do have this top in this pretty blue floral and in white. The next top I tried on is this teal button front blouse. It has puff sleeves with a random seam on them, and I tried this one on in a size small and it was $20. First of all, I really love the color of this top. I think it's really pretty. It's definitely on the shorter side for me, but the puff sleeves are nice nothing unusual there. The neckline is really unique and beautiful though and it does have those nice buttons down the front and they also have this top in this green pink and brown plaid which is unique to say the least. Next we have this light pink embroidered top. It has three quarter length sleeves so I decided to include it and they're gathered at the bottom. It has this really pretty embroidery at the top of the shirt and I tried this one on in a size small and it was $29.99. This top is is definitely a little bit see-through. You can see my dark pants through it, but I did really like the color of it. It's a very relaxed fit 
and it's actually a pretty simple shirt other than the embroidery at the top which I do think adds a really pretty detail and this is the only color that this top comes in next I grabbed this pink lace Henley shirt the sleeves on it are pretty simple, but it has this really pretty lace and lattice details at the top in addition to the buttons. And I tried this one on in a size small and it was $25. The fabric on this one is very soft and comfortable. I love that the details are a little bit more subtle, but I think that's really nice actually. It's definitely a relaxed fit, which adds to the comfortability. And they also have this top in black and ivory. The next blouse I tried on is this light blue flutter sleeve top complete with a lot of wrinkles in it. It has the flutter sleeves, a crew neck, and I tried this one on in a size small and it was $20. First of all, I think we need to talk about the ruffle sleeves because wow, they are something. I do like how they look, but I think that for me personally, I would feel the need to be fixing them all the time, case in point. And I am also just not really in love with the crinkly, wrinkly nature of the fabric, but they do have this top in a bunch of other solid colors. Next, we have this light blue eyelet tank top. It has a scalloped hem at the bottom, which is beautiful. It has lace along the non-existent sleeves. And I tried this one on in a size small and it was $28. I really liked this one. I think the cutouts in it are so pretty. I love the scalloped hem and I love that there are lace for sleeves. My only issue with it is the fit or maybe it's the sizing. There was a lot of extra space in the armpit area so I would definitely need to size down to an extra small which is crazy and they also have this top in white and this light pinky purple the next top is this light pink Henley shirt it has these two angled seams running down the front and a gathered seam under the bust and it has this beautiful embroidery on the shoulders and sleeves and I tried this one on in a size small and it was $24.99 the color of this one is really pretty I'll Although you can see my dark pants through it slightly. The seams running down the front add a little bit of interest, but for me the best detail on this top is the embroidery at the top of it. I thought it was really pretty and that seam under the bust does add some shape as well. And this top also comes in gray. The next top I grabbed is this gold tiered top. It has this lattice detail near the bottom. The sleeves are gathered for a puff sleeve and it has lace at the top with the button closure on the back. And I tried this one on in a size small and it was $28. This one fits slightly tighter on the top and then it flares out with the ruffles. I think it fits well overall. The lattice detail on the bottom does not have a lining behind it, which I actually like. The lace detail on the top is a nice subtle detail. So there's not really anything that I didn't like about this one. And Target also has this one in this light pink color. Next we have this light purple raglan top. The sleeve is gathered gathered, the neckline is square, and it has this unique double elastic waist. I tried this one on in a size small and it was $25. I think the color of this one is great for spring. The double elastic waist definitely gives me a nice shape. There's almost like a peplum effect with it. I was testing what it would look like if the waist rode up, which is bound to happen. I think that the square neckline is a great choice for this top. I think it fits very well and the fabric was really soft and comfortable and this one comes in light blue as well. The last top that I grabbed is this kind of red orange embroidered blouse. The sleeves are a simple cut with a little bit of embroidery on them. It's pin tucked on the front on either side of the buttons and I tried this one on in a size small and it was $29.99. I think the color of this one is really unique. The simplicity of the sleeves is really beautiful and it's got that seam under the bust all the way around to add more shape. I love how the embroidery is slightly creeping onto the sleeves and the pin tucking in the front with the buttons is really nice. So overall I thought this one was a really great top and they don't have it in any other colors which I think is okay because I really like this color. <laughs> I am back in the car. That was really fun. Some of those tops are beautiful. If you want to check out any of the blouses, shirts, tops, whatever you want to call them that I tried on today, I'll be sure to link all of them down below and let me know down in the comments where do you want me to go next and what do you want me to try on. Well, that is all I have for you today. I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to give it a big thumbs up if you have not already. You can subscribe if you have not already and you would like to, but I will see you in my next video. Bye!